It's September 5th, 2014, and we're just downstairs at the Q-Lofts looking at uh, some of the innovative things that we're doing to increase the uh, acoustic separation between units here on the walls. Here, we're just going to have a quick look at uh, what we're doing on the floor. So right now, I'm up in the, uh, the penthouse level off the, uh, off the Q-Lofts, and we're getting ready to, uh, to do a concrete overpour here on Monday. And you'll see we've got all the uh, all the radiant floor piping is here on the floor. Uh, but what you probably don't notice is that it's not sitting on uh, on wood. What we have here is actually that's a uh, a rubber mat that we put everywhere uh, that's on top of the uh, top of the wood structure. And the idea is uh, when you're in this space, there will be a completely separate concrete slab. That doesn't touch any of the uh, any of the structure anywhere. So you see the the rubber goes up all the way around the perimeter, so that when somebody's in this space, uh, moving around or dragging a chair around or vacuuming or doing uh, any number of other things that can make uh, noise, that can be an annoyance to the person below. You have a concrete slab that's completely free floating, that's actually not touching the uh, the structure. So uh, the rubber that we use here, it's about uh, four millimeters thick. Um, the thickness of it isn't as important as just the simple fact that it's, uh, that it's actually there and in place because it, uh, it significantly decreases, decreases the amount of vibration that you get going through the, uh, through the structure. So uh, just like those clips on the, uh, on the walls, uh, this is something that uh, is done a lot in uh, in other markets. I know they they do it a lot in the uh, in the United States in multi-unit residential construction, but I'm not aware of anybody in the Atlantic Canada market that uh, that does this to uh, provide a superior level of soundproofing uh, between the uh, between the floor levels in the uh, within uh, a multi-unit residential building. So that's it. Just. Uh, Quick, uh, quick video so you get a better idea for what we're doing on the upper side of the, uh, the floors here at the, uh, the Q lofts. We're actually doing this on the uh, mezzanine levels of the lofts as well. So it's not just between units, but in the uh, mezzanine levels, it's being done uh, within the unit as well to decrease on the uh, sound transfer from uh, one unit through to the uh, unit next door. So uh, that's it with respect to the uh, uh, rubber soundproofing membrane that we're doing here at the Q-Lots.